there's somebody who you and I, I think, both admire, and we both met him. In fact, he's actually, you actually held a do in Manchester, and he was your guest yeah. of honour. And it's a chap called Calvin Robinson, yeah. who our viewers may, may know mm. him. He's an incredibly tall, <laughs> he must be six foot seven or something, yeah. he's massive. He's an incredibly tall black guy, he's a vicar, I think. Is he now a vicar or something? I'm not sure. He's a deacon. He's a deacon. He's been very, very outspoken. Yeah. He's affiliated with uh, Lawrence Fox. Has very, very strong views on yeah. on uh, Muslims about uh, what's happening in the country. He is a Christian, yeah. so he he has some views that you know maybe you and I don't, or maybe I don't particularly agree with. But he's quitting the UK. Mm. I don't know if you've seen that yeah. on the. So an interview we did on it. Yeah, and, and it's a real blow to us, I think, or to me, because he's a, a very articulate, very, very courageous individual who speaks his mind, you know, to, you know, walks his, you know, blows apart all this stuff like about critical race theory, about, you know, all, all these sort of stuff, mm. kind of exposes, exposes the frailties of the woke and the left, extreme left uh, lies. But he's off to Michigan, I think. Uh, yeah. to run a parish there. What are your views? Now, he said on, on various interviews, his exit, that I'll still be fighting the fight, but I'll be in America. What are your views on, on him? When I first saw the announcement, I thought to myself, coward. <laughs> um, since my favourite word at the moment, I know, coward. I know. Um, him and my bloke, my, my yeah. Blackpool bloke. Yeah. And then he did a, he did a podcast with a New Culture Forum. I thought, I'll watch that. And when I watched it, he explained himself and it makes sense what he's saying. Um, he's not quitting the UK. He's not running away from the UK. He trained to be a deacon, a priest, better word for priest. Um, and he wants his own parish. Uh, Church of England kicked him out. Um, and now he's been offered one in America, um, which is going, he's going there to do that. And like he said on this podcast, he said, all the work I do, fighting the good fight, is online. Mm. Um, so that's not going to stop because I don't need to be in the UK because, mm. you know, I'm not leading demonstrations. I'm not standing up in Parliament. Everything I do is online. I will carry on the fight. And he said, in fact, be even better, um, I'm going to be building a studio in the church of yes, the parish that, that I'm going yeah. to. So I'll have our own studio there. So it was framed wrongly and maybe he did it on purpose um, to frame it like that. But when he speaks about it, he's not running away. He's taking a job offer because like us all, he needs money. You know, it's a job offer. Um, and he's going to carry on the fight from over there. And he said at next general election, he'll be coming back and he'll be standing for parliament. Oh, did he say that? Yeah. I didn't see that. Yeah. yeah, I'll vote for him. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. unless you're standing against him. Yeah, well, I hope not. Um, but he's standing for UKIP. He's a UKIP member now. Oh, has he, he joined UKIP, has he? He's yeah. got an official position in UKIP. You mean reform? UKIP. Oh, is UKIP still yeah. around, is it? Yeah. All oh, right. The yeah. tiny. Yeah, I was going to say. He's joined I would have thought re reform would have been more of his natural home. He doesn't like Nigel Farage, he said on this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> did you enjoy that video? I think he did. Come on now, hit that bell, subscribe, comment. Let's build this channel. I need more followers. I need more subscribers. Be part of the journey. See you soon.